Hey guys, welcome to another video. My name is Hannah and today is my birthday. I decided that for this video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys the 19 things that I've learned in 19 years. Let's go bake a cake. Number one, messy room equals messy mind. Clean room equals clean mind. The state of my room always reciprocates my headspace, so I always try to keep a clean room so I have clarity. And when it's always better to clean when there's music in the background, especially 80s dance music. Without counsel, plans fail. In the words of my dad, if you fail to plan, you plan to fail. And I learned that the hard way. Be the friend that you'd like to have. In a world where we're always reminded to check up on our friends because of the rise of anxiety and depression, I think it's important that we should begin with the man in the mirror, aka yourself. There are seasonal friends and there are forever friends. I believe that each person that God introduces us to has a specific role in our life, and sometimes they're meant to stay there forever, and sometimes they're only meant to stay for a short period of time. One of my best friends, Elise, sent me an article on this topic. Link down below. Number five. True friendships stand the test of time and distance. So I'm the only one left from my high school barcada in Manila. But that doesn't mean that our barcada is no more. It's like we're all just taking an extended vacation and when we see each other, we're just going to have extended cuento. <laughs> Number six, if you feel something, write it down. A journal, a letter, a song. <laughs> Budget your income. Budget your income. 10% tithe, 20% saving, 20% don't touch until you are married so that you have money to fund your house or a car or for your kids and 50% miscellaneous shopping or stuff that I'd want to buy for myself that I don't necessarily need but that I want. I work for my money and when I budget it like this, I don't feel guilty when I go shopping because I always put aside for the future. We all need mentors. We need someone that we can run to for advice someone we can rant to, someone to give us constructive criticism from a place of love, someone who could stretch you and someone who could lead you in the right direction. Be it your parents, friends, your pastor, whoever it may be, if they are older, wiser, and a role model to you, then they can be your mentor. Number nine. I don't think I have enough fingers for all of these numbers. Number nine. I'm gonna stop when we reach 10 because I don't, I don't know how I'm gonna be like. Number 12. Number nine, document everything. Document everything. Dude, document everything. Hannah, document everything. Girl, document everything. This is me talking to my high school self. I wish that I took videos and pictures and wrote on my journal more when I was in high school, but I did not because I was like, nah, it's okay, I'll remember it, Naman. No, I won't remember it, Naman. For someone as forgetful as I am, I need a place where these memories can reside somewhere outside of my head. It's not about me. Everything that I do, I do because I want to give God the glory. I am nothing without Him. I strive to be a great example of how spectacular His creations could be. Whoa, I think I went too close to the camera there. Let me just move back a bit. How do I become the best version of myself? I have to love like He loves us. Keep your receipts. When taxes are due, you will regret throwing them away. Be on time. I mean, let's all be honest, it's really not that hard to get up 10 minutes earlier than you usually do. And the benefits of being on time totally outweigh the disadvantages. Number one, you are less stressed. Number two, you are more respectful of others. Number three, you have the audacity to look at people when they're late and give them the side eye, like. Don't come at me, friends. I'm still learning this. Peace. Number 14. Blush over the nose. Say yes more. Unless it's imperative to say no, which well, you can you can say no, but like if you could say yes, just say yes. Just say yes. Just, just say yes. Cuddle with your mom, watch a movie with your dad. In other words, spend time with your loved ones and don't take them for granted. Good company says bye bye to bad character. Stand firm and you will win life. Let's go get the cake. <laughs> Number 19, I may be getting older, 
but I refuse to grow up. Thanks for watching.